Before installing this mount, please make sure you read the manual thoroughly. Tool check. To install this product, you will need an electric drill, a 1 8 inch drill bit, a box end wrench, a Phillips screwdriver, a level, a pencil, and an electronic stud finder. It's also a good idea to have an awl or small nail to verify stud locations. Parts check. Check carefully to make sure there are no missing or damaged parts. Depending on your installation, you may not need every part provided. If any parts are missing or damaged, contact customer service by calling 1-800-359-5520 to have the part sent directly to you. Step 1. Prepare the ceiling for mounting. Please note, the ceiling plate is not attached to the ceiling in this step. For flat ceilings, proceed to step 1-1. If you have a sloped ceiling, proceed to step 1-2. Step 1-1. Prepare a flat ceiling for mounting. Please note, for safe installation, the wood joist size must be 2 by 4 inches or larger, and any drywall or other wall covering material may not exceed 5 eighths an inch in thickness. Use an electronic stud finder to locate and mark a joist. At this time, it's a good idea to verify joist location with an awl or thin nail. Using two bolts, attach the swivel mount to the ceiling plate. Hold the ceiling plate against the ceiling to verify the correct location for your mount. Verify the tab on the ceiling plate is facing the projector screen. Mark two hole locations with a pencil. After you have marked the hole locations, use the 1 8 inch drill bit to drill the two hole locations to a depth of 3 inches. Step 1-2. Prepare a sloped ceiling for mounting. Please note, for safe installation, the wood joist size must be 2 by 4 inches or larger, and any drywall or other wall covering material may not exceed 5 eighths an inch in thickness. Use an electronic stud finder to locate and mark a joist. At this time, it's a good idea to verify joist location with an awl or thin nail. Using two bolts, attach the head of the extension assembly to the ceiling plate. Hold the ceiling plate against the ceiling to verify the correct location for your mount. Verify the tab on the ceiling plate is facing the projector screen. Mark two hole locations with a pencil. After you have marked the hole locations, Use the 1 8 inch drill bit to drill the two hole locations to a depth of 3 inches. Step 2. Attach the projector bracket to the projector. First, determine the screw diameter your projector requires. Hand thread a screw into a hole on the top of your projector. If you encounter any resistance, stop and select another screw diameter until you have the correct size. Align the holes on the arms of the projector bracket with the holes on the top of the projector. Secure the arms into place by turning the cap nuts on the top of the bracket clockwise. Attach the bracket to the projector by threading a bolt through the appropriate flat washer, followed by the bracket, and finally into the projector. Use a level to ensure the bracket is square with the projector. Step 3. Attach the ceiling plate to the ceiling. For flat ceilings, proceed to step 3-1. If you have a sloped ceiling, proceed to step 3-2. Step 3-1. Attach the ceiling plate to a flat ceiling. Attach the ceiling plate to the ceiling using the two lag bolts and lag bolt washers. Tighten the bolts with a box end wrench. Do not over tighten the bolts. Attach the ceiling cover by pressing it onto the ceiling plate. Step 3-2. Attach the ceiling plate to a sloped ceiling. 
Carefully screw the threaded extension tube into the extension assembly head until it is secure. Insert the tube locking screw into the extension assembly head and tighten with an Allen wrench. Do not over tighten the screw. Carefully screw the swivel mount onto the threaded extension tube until it is secure. Insert the mount locking screw into the swivel mount and tighten with an Allen wrench. Do not over tighten the screw. Attach the ceiling plate to the ceiling using two lag bolts and lag bolt washers. Tighten the bolts with a box end wrench. Do not over tighten the bolts. Attach the ceiling cover by pressing it onto the ceiling plate. Step 4. Attach the projector and projector bracket to the swivel mount. Screw four inserts onto the top of the projector bracket. Ensure the insert's flat side is facing up. Align the inserts with openings on the swivel mount. Lock the projector into place by rotating the inserts clockwise and the mount counterclockwise. If you ever need to remove the projector, rotate the inserts counterclockwise and the swivel mount clockwise to unlock the projector. Step 5. Adjust the projector position. To make a yaw adjustment, remove the ceiling cover and loosen the bolts on the ceiling plate with a box end wrench. Move the projector left or right until the projected image is properly aligned with the projector screen. Retighten the bolts and reattach the ceiling cover. To make a pitch adjustment, loosen the pitch adjustment locking screw on the swivel mount with a Phillips screwdriver. Move the projector up or down until the projected image is properly aligned with the projector screen. Retighten the pitch adjustment locking screw. To make a roll adjustment, loosen the roll adjustment locking screw on the swivel mount with a Phillips screwdriver. Move the projector clockwise or counterclockwise until the projected image is properly aligned with the projector screen. Retighten the roll adjustment locking screw. Step 6. Install the projector bracket cover. Slide the projector bracket cover over the top of the bracket and snap it into place. You are now ready to enjoy your newly mounted projector. Thank you for your interest in this Sanus projector mount. If you have any problems with this product or have questions about installation, please do not return it to the store. Instead, contact customer service at 1-800-359-5520.